This segment of Bridge Street is brought to you by Cambridge Paving Stones with ArmorTech. We're here at Northern Nurseries here in Cicero and just in time for the summer, we have some great outdoor spaces that you might want to take a look at for your own backyard. And here with us is Territory Manager Dick Gilmore from Cambridge Paving Stones. Hi, Dick. How you doing? Good. How are you? Good. We're standing here in a, a pretty unique outdoor space to start off with. Do you want to tell me a little bit about it? Yeah, this is our outdoor uh, kitchen kit. This is an actual kit that we make that you can build yourself. This is our 20-year bull grill with the granite tops that people can have in their own backyard. Well, and it's, it's become pretty popular over the last few years, as I understand, right, to do more with your outdoor space than just maybe putting a patio table and chairs out. That is correct. <laughs> well, what they're trying to do is to take the inside and bring it outside. Mm -hmm. So we've accommodated that with different types of kits. We have fireplaces, we have bistro tables that they can have as part of it. You can expand your patio and build on it so you can design it. And what should somebody who's looking to maybe revamp their outdoor space uh, what would you tell them to do if they were coming out here for the first time and didn't know what to expect? Well, what I would do is recommend that they go online on our website at cambridgepavingstones.com and get our visualizer, take a picture of your backyard, and you can actually put all the different pieces together in that visualizer and see it at your own home. And if you're not comfortable doing that, we have a company called Online Designs mm -hmm. that we can literally take a picture, send it, and do the whole thing, and you will have it. Well, and what's interesting is you said this earlier that you can even start small. You don't necessarily have to start and do everything. You can start with one space and then you could grow and add to that? That's correct. We could start today with a 10 by 10 or a 10 by 20 or whatever size you have for right now for your budget and just build on it. Dick, tell me a little bit about what we're looking at here. <laughs> yes, this is our uh, pre-made gas fire pit and you can basically have natural gas going through it, have the flames immediately, don't haul any wood, it's ready to go. And we made it within a sitting uh, arrangement here so people can sit around it and talk. It seats a lot of people, too. It looks like it's a nice open space, right? That's correct. Well, great. And uh, how popular are you, know, are you seeing these outdoor um, gas fireplaces nowadays? We sell a lot of gas fire pits. <laughs> Wood and fire, uh, gas fire, both of them, we sell a ton of them. I see actually a, a more traditional looking fireplace over here. That's correct. This could be traditional or maybe gas, correct? That is correct. This can have a gas option to it so you can set it up and just do the same thing as we're doing with the fire pit where you just turn it on and you can have instant fire. Or you can use wood if you prefer to have wood in there. So this is a much more elaborate design, but if you want something a little simpler, you even have something for somebody like that as well. This would be your alternative where you have your fire pit that you can actually have your outside fire in and you can even do some cooking on it and the grills actually pull apart so they don't have to be in the way. And this is simple too, it's not as, uh, not as fancy let's say as one of these great fireplaces back here but still something that's manageable, looks great on a patio, yeah. correct? It takes about an hour to put that together. Oh wow. Yeah, it's that simple. Look at these split, right? <laughs> Well, and can we also talk a little bit about, you know, I know you have different paving stones here, and uh, maybe do you want to just talk a little bit about the different kinds of stones sure. that you offer? Sure. So this happens to be our Ledgestone XL. Okay. There's three different pieces. It has larger clefts in it uh -huh. so that you get a texture like natural stone, uh -huh. different colors. And then this is our smaller with the smaller texture. Okay. So some people want a little less texture, we can go to this. If that's something that they don't want and they want to even go more, over on the kitchen area we have what we call the XL Smooth. Ah, and okay. there's no texture, so you can do a little bit of both. So that's uh, actually the Cambridge Paving Stones with Armatec. Mm -hmm. And then the Armatec is going to be two lifetimes as far as the warranty goes, so the colors will always stay the same for that entire period. It's really uh, the artist is the contractor putting it in. He can make this look magical when he gets done with it. Mm -hmm. And you end up, it's, now it's a matter of picking the proper color, what, what stone you like the best, and it's, a, it's your, your uh, choice. And in some of these spaces though, for instance, a fire pit, you know, you, you'd mentioned it only takes an, an hour to build it. So there are some that are maybe easier than others, but they seem pretty simple in, in the grand scheme of things once you have everything set. That is correct. And we have instructions that you follow line by line. Well, great. Well, thank you so much for speaking with us today. And we just want to remind people that if they'd like more information, you could visit cambridgepavers.com. And there's all the information online, uh, right? That's correct. Okay, great. Well, thank you so much. Thank you.